So Hashbang TV coming from Joycon London 2012. We're with Awam yeah. and you're over from Ghana. Yeah. Welcome. <laughs> Thank you. So how have you come how are you in London? Um so I won a British Council Award as a young creative entrepreneur in Ghana. So we all came here for a program to have a tour at the UK media industries from different um, countries. So right. we were 17 and I was the only one coming from Ghana. What? Yeah. So that's what um, that's what brought me here. Awesome. Yes. <laughs> so tell us a little bit about your company. What do you do? Yeah, so Let Games is a video games development company in Africa. Um, actually one of the very first um, game development focused in Africa. And our mission is to grow the gaming industry in Africa as well. So not just a company. Mm. Um, we strive to use local expertise yep. to make games that compete globally. So we have games from Africa, not game for Africa, but right. games from Africa. So that is our vision. So um, we try to encourage people that gaming is something that can actually give them their lifetime jobs. Because in Africa, there's a vacuum. There's a music industry, there's a movie industry, but the intersection isn't there, which is the games. So we feel that when that vacuum is filled, um, it will create more opportunities for the creative media industry people. Um, an architect doesn't have to wait for his building to be built in real life before he sees that he has done some work. We can buy his 3D model and then project it in yeah. the game. Cool. Um, a graphic designer can advertise in our games. Companies shouldn't be going around looking for billboards in physical life um, trying to advertise. They can advertise in our game. So that is the focus of Letty Games. We are just trying to bring the second dimension to Africa. And, 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 this, and this all started for you when you were uh, in college and you started developing an iPhone game and it was the first yeah. iPhone game to be published into yeah. iTunes from yeah. Sub-Saharan Africa, is that yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. Wow. Because um, actually this has been my passion from childhood. I started doing this from class to stage two. I used to write my own stories, I used to draw my own comics when I was a youngster. And you should talk to my son. Oh. <laughs> he does that. Stuff. Exactly. <laughs> we need and to get him into software. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I was so passionate. So in um, junior high school, I drew this very nice comic and then I really wanted to advertise its game in my comic because I had this stack of comics mm. and then I saw Batman, I saw that play Batman on Super Nintendo, on uh, Nintendo. so okay. I wanted that. That was what forced me to, to learn how to develop games. So I grew very curious and I self-taught myself how to make games. So I made that game in QBasic for my comic in junior high school. Wow. And then and then it got better and better and better. And then um, now I'm doing that full time. And uh, I just want to keep my story consistent that passion and persistence can make you successful. That's, so, a, that's a good message? Yep, yeah, exactly. So um, I'm um, working on this on passion. Um, I got very interesting partners. Um, my partner is from Kenya. Um, we had a very funny way that we met. Um, I transformed the game I did in junior high school into my final year thesis when I was in the university. Uh, okay. So it was actually the first 3D game that I made in my university. That was in 2006. But a year later, I read in the local newspapers that the first 3D game has been made in Africa. Right. I did, and it wasn't me. <laughs> so I googled him, and it was this Kenyan guy taking all the credit. <laughs> so yeah. So that's how we met. We met online and then um, with the help of Meltwater, the foundation that I work with yeah. now, um, they brought us together and then we are starting Letty Games okay. full time now. That's Fantastic. Cool. And is it is it based in Ankara then? Yeah. Both, so he's moved from Kenya to Ghana? Exactly. So now we even have the Letty Games Ke uh, Kenya and Letty Games Ghana. Okay. We have two, we have ah, two offices cool. now. Fantastic. Yeah. Cool. So we're obviously at Joy-Con uh, for yep. the next couple of days. Yep. So what would what would a good outcome for you be at Joy-Con Joy Day? Yeah, so actually I'm here to meet uh, like minds, to actually create that awareness that Africa is also um, growing gradually. Yep. Um, I showed some excellent artworks um, uh, 
um, uh, just, just some minutes ago. Um, so we make very quality content, and then the software industry is also growing. Um, so I want to meet like minds, create the awareness, um, possible found fundraising as well. Uh -huh. um, also get contacts, yep. um, especially in the UK industry, to see if we could um, collaborate in developing very robust um, games. Uh, because we are, I'm the developer myself. I've trained other two people in game development. They are excellent programmers in Ghana, but then you have to train them into games. Yeah, yeah making games is quite different from just native programming. Totally, yeah. So, so, yeah, it's been a challenge getting resource in Africa, right? But then we are gra growing it gradually. Brilliant. So I intend to meet people here that I could outsource some stuff to, or we could partner to distribute our games in the UK or in the US, um, since we have um, our games on the Android platform as well. Um, this would be a very good opportunity. So final question. Think forward five years, you've built a successful company in Ghana. Um, how important is Android as a platform to the whole of Sub-Saharan Africa in terms of accessibility of development, of you know being able to let that creativity flow? How important is that? Affordability of devices. Everything, yeah. In terms of social change, yeah. how important? What, very, what things do you see happening over five years? Very, very important. I feel in the next five years, everyone will have an Android device because it's growing so quick. Um, you should know of the Huawei ADOS. Yeah. It got finished when it was. Anytime it comes in, everybody absorbs it. Samsung Galaxy Pocket is also doing very well. And they are all very cheap Android phones. Yeah. And an average person can just um, buy it. I'm even giving it as a present to my 73-year-old dad so I can be what's yeah, up yeah, with yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. yeah, so Android will be really huge. It's, it's, it's taking over the smartphone industry in Africa, actually. Yeah, so, sure. I think the next five years, everybody will have an Android. That's why Android is so important to us. So, so you mentioned WhatsApp, right? Yeah. Uh, so messaging is huge. Messaging What's the next killer app for Africa then, in terms of you know the ability to run an application on Android, and, and if there's 70% yeah. penetration, exactly. what is it? What's the app? Interactive games. Right. Interactive yeah, yeah, yeah. games. That's the app. That. That. Yeah. So, 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 so for us, we've built this huge framework that um, that works like a mini WhatsApp as yeah, yeah. well, so that people can use to play games as well. Because, uh, okay. yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, competitive yeah. games. So we host our games in a way where, on the mobile device, so it's like a mobile game center. So you can be playing a game with a friend and be chatting with him at yeah, the same yeah, yeah. time. And it plugs into all other social networks as well. Cool. Yeah. So, Sounds good. Yeah. yeah. So, so if people want to get in contact with you, how do they reach you? Oh, you can um, get me on Facebook, aram.tavia. And then you can also reach me on Twitter, Aram Tivia, and you can also send me an email, Aram at LettyGames.com. And if we search, if, if we search Google for Letty Games, you, Letty you games, come you up and see easy. It. Exactly. Brilliant. You will see it. Lovely to meet you. Yeah, lovely to meet you. Thanks for coming on. Oh, thank Appreciate you. It. It's a pleasure. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. <laughs>